All right, I'm at 3564 Willow Tree Trace in uh, Decatur. This is DeKalb County. This is a uh, really cute neighborhood with a predominantly uh, brick front houses through most of the neighborhood. But back here at the back of the neighborhood, you'll see we have a lot of uh, just sided houses. But as we came to the front, we saw a lot of brick. And, uh, but it's a very clean neighborhood very well maintained these are all a little bit bigger we're right here by the cul-de-sac and uh, the house is actually in really great condition um, we do have a few things that need to be addressed um, inside and out um, you can see there's a piece of fascia missing there from the uh, the peak the house does need to be pressure clean I'm going to put a couple of new lights there around the front door paint the front door and uh, the trim around it uh, we do have a broken garage door here that we're going to want to replace but the uh, roof has at some point been changed. It's actually a really good looking roof, so not gonna be isu any issues or problems there. Uh, siding does need to be pressure washed and uh, have a few bulging pieces of siding that we just need to get tacked back down into place. As we come around to the back, we, uh, we do have a few broken windows, like the uh, top pane right there, but not broken all the way through. Doesn't look like anybody's been into the house or uh, vandalized the house. Um, have a nice size concrete patio back here. But I'm uh, going to go ahead and take these two uh, decaying fences out and just really open up the backyard. We've got a nice little level play area back here. Have some nice trees and bushes to offer some screening from the neighbors. Has a real private feeling back here. <coughs> Which you can see there at the top. Uh, what I mean by the uh, siding bulges a little bit. We do have a few little siding repairs. You can see we've got some weed whacker damage there right by the downspout. And uh, as we continue around the house, just uh, further adding to the value and uh, the type of neighborhood that it is, both of our AC units are still in place. Uh, one of them actually looks like a very relatively new unit. Uh, one's a little bit older. One's uh, very new. Again, a couple pieces of siding pulled away just a little bit. Want to clean up the uh, the yard, put a little pine straw down in front of the uh, the bushes. But uh, heading in, I really was surprised to find how nice everything was. Um, really don't need anything more than touch-up paint. And I think we're going to be able to get away with just uh, cleaning the carpets. The uh, carpet's been in surprisingly good condition couple little stains here and there but um, whoever was in the house took really good care of it uh, all in all um, again you see carpets are looking pretty good do have a little bit of staining in the high traffic area but the uh, the pile feels good and I think we've got some good long life left in this uh, it's a real open feeling floor plan um, we do have our bathroom probably need to put a new uh, new fixtures there and uh, go ahead and replace the flooring uh, in the bathrooms, the kitchen. Speaking of the kitchen, it does need a little bit of tension in here. Uh, builder made the mistake of putting in um, white countertops, which uh, never really hold up that well. So want to uh, not replace the countertops, but resurface them. Um, have a little wear on the cabinets. Some of the, uh, the wraps are pulling away. So want to get those painted. Um, it has all the appliances in place and they all appear to work. They're all desperately need cleaning. Um, but I don't think that we're going to have to go through the expense of replacing those. They are a little bit older, but, uh, but I don't think there's any reason for us to do anything with it. Um, flooring definitely needs to be changed. Uh, nice two inch plantation blinds, uh, through most of the house. A few need to be replaced. They've had a little damage to it, but, um, should be pretty minimal expense, but you can see, even here in the living room, carpet and paint overall look really good. Um, heading into the garage, get a light on in here. Our, our biggest issue here in the garage is there is a leak from either the tub or the shower. And uh, the ceiling has already started to fall just here in this one little section. So uh, what we want to do is go ahead and cut that area out 
uh, fix the leak from below and not worry about doing it from above since we already have the damage that needs to be fixed. Should be a very simple fix. Uh, newer looking hot water heater. Both of the uh, garage door openers are here and in place, but this is the, uh, the one that is broken and we're gonna wanna replace, if we can, just that panel on the garage door, but may end up having to replace the whole door. Uh, behind me is the uh, laundry room. We need to get a new plug for the uh, dryer there. We've got a nice size pantry. Need one of the shelves in there to be replaced. Coat closet, should have a pair of them. Again, heading up the stairs, the stairs are probably where the carpet is the worst, but I'm really hoping that, that what stains there are, are just gonna come up with a cleaning, and I fully expect they will. Coming to the top of the steps, we've got a nice little kind of catwalk, balcony feel overlooking the front and the front door. Very open here, so a very inviting layout. We have full bath here just off the top of the steps. We have our first bedroom. Again, bedroom walls actually, all in all, look pretty good. A little touch up, an occasional place that needs to be uh, patched, but uh, almost ready to show. Um, second bedroom, again, carpet looking good. Closet looks just fine. Just need some uh, knobs on the closet door, and uh, we'll be good in there. Third bedroom, again, same condition. No major issues, no big concerns. And then lastly, our master, which is a nice size, uh, probably 20, not 20, 12 by 18. Um, we do have one big stain in here. Hopefully that's going to come up. Um, just don't know until we try. Um, in the bathroom, we've got our separate shower, a garden tub. Flooring definitely wants to be changed, needs to be changed. Uh, definitely need to get things cleaned up. We've got one little patch to the wall to take place. Have a very nice size well laid out closet and then our toilet behind closed doors so really like this four bedroom two and a half bath nice open good neighborhood easy access to the highway um, minimal rehab compared to some that we've looked at so uh, all in all I'm, I'm a fan of this property